Hey everybody, so this is a quick little tutorial on how to save any of your created work from Quaver and how to save it as an mp3. So an mp3 is an audio file. Um, so I'm just going to go into like Quebec Beat. So if I'm in Quebec Beat, so I'm going to open up a file. I go to file open. Um, let's see. Uh, we'll pick this. Ickerly Spicy Music. I'm not really sure what that is, but <laughs> we'll check it out anyway. Um, okay, so it looks like we've got one measure. Uh, let's pick something that's a little longer than that. Okay, the Techno Tango by Miss Murray. Here we go. Open. File open. Okay, here we go. Cool. All right. Sounds pretty cool, right? So I want to be able to share that with a lot of other people, but they may not all have access to Quaver the way that I do. So how I can share this is I would go to File, and I would click on Make MP3, okay? It's going to ask me if I want to publish this. I'm going to click Publish, okay? And then it's gonna tell me to put in a title for my MP3, okay? I'm gonna give it the exact same title as the file name is. You don't have to give it the same title, but I'm going to. The Techno Tango by Miss Kamari. And I click okay. Really? So now it's telling me that they're working on it and you click OK. All right. Now sometimes in Quaver there's a little tab down here that it's an alert tab and it'll tell you when something is ready. Um, sometimes there's a tab there, sometimes there's not. Um, but if you can't, if it doesn't have an alert tab right here, you can always find your MP3 by clicking File and clicking download, right? So I wanna find the most recently published one. Okay, so, oh look, I've made this a couple times apparently. So see here, this was published today. So I'm gonna click on that and I'm gonna click download. Okay, and it's automatically going, it's asking me where I want to save it. Um, I'm going to put it in my documents and click save. So now I have this MP3 in the actual computer and I can then email it to people I could text it to people. So now I have options of how to share this. And this isn't just for Q Backbeat. You can do this with other creative areas. So I'm gonna go to File, Exit. Okay, so let's say I go to Q Composer. I can do the same thing there. I can open a file, it's loading, here we go, so it's 
So if I want to save that as an MP3 to share it with other people, again, I would go to click File, Make MP3. You're going to click Publish. And I'm going to give this a name. Okay, it says it's done. So now if I want to find my MP3, now that I've saved this as an MP3, I'm going to go to download. And it's best if you look by date, because it'll help you to find what you're looking for. I've made lots of samples, so I want to find the one that I made today. Wait, oh, not that. And by the way, this also, um, when you go into your downloads, it's also, it's going to show everything from the creative side. So anything that you could possibly do in the lab. So Q Composer Backbeat is all going to be, it's all going to be listed here when you go to download. All right, so I want to find the one that I just did. Where is it? I just saw it. Oh no, the battery's going to die soon. Okay. Try to be fast. Where is it? Aha. No, that was the one I've already made. Ah, where is it? Here we go. Okay. Example B. Boom. Download. Save to my documents. Whoops. There we go. I'm going to exit. You can also do this in QStrum. So again, anything you make. I think I might have something in here. Uh -huh. Here we go. All right, so I've got this cool thing going on in QStrum. and I want to share that. So I'm going to make it an MP3, click publish, give it a name, example C, click OK, OK, file, download, example C. And I download that and see how it tells you it was done in QStrum right here. QStrum, download, save, and I'll give you one more example in QGrooves. QGrooves is when you're pulling in loops, preset loops that are in here to mix and match sounds. And I'm going to open one that I've already made. I want to share that so I'm gonna click file make mp3 and click OK and to find it make mp3 whoops we already did that part I'm gonna download it All right, and see this one, it tells you right here, it's done in Q Grooves. Download, save, boom. Okay, 